How's it going guys? Welcome back to Koyo's Project. Today we're going to be doing another episode in my Inkscape tutorial series. Today's topic is how to save your project as a PNG file. This is pretty simple, pretty straightforward. You go to your uh, project and you go to file and you go export PNG image. And that's going to open this toolbox for you. And this, uh, this is pretty cool because there's uh, several things you can do. You can export the page, which means everything within this canvas is going to be exported and anything uh, you know outside of the canvas is not going to be exported. So in this case, uh, my turtle's head, he's, he's going to be cut off. Uh, so I probably, I probably don't want to do that in this case. Um, you can also do drawing and that's going to select everything you've drawn and it's going to include all the white space. So if I were to move this all the way over here, it's going to export this whole white space, um, the exact height and width of this. So probably don't want to do that in this case either. Move him back. Um, we can also do selection. This is pretty nice because we can say select just the turtle. We don't want the background, just the turtle. And that will give us a transparent background when we export it as PNG. Um, or I can select just the turtle and the background and it'll exclude this. And it will be the exact dimensions of this square, which is pretty nice. Um, I can also do custom. I, I really don't use custom. I don't know. I don't know why you would use custom personally. Um, so I'm just going to skip over that. The next part we're going to want to cover is going to export as. All this is going to be is what you're going to save it as the name, obviously, um, and where you want to export it to. So you're going to hit save. And this is kind of confusing because at least for me, I, I first thought, oh, I hit save. It must be saved as a PNG, but it's not. You have to go down to this little check mark and let me select that export. And that's it. Pretty easy. Thanks for watching guys. If you like this tutorial, please like, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Uh, if you have any tutorials you'd like me to do in the future, please put them in the comments. Thanks for watching guys.